Hello, I'm Guillaume Barido, pre-sale engineer for Systenza. Today, let's explore the new AppliDis Fusion 5 administration console. Right from the start, AppliDis has a built-in web administration console. This new version is based fully on HTML5, which means that it works with any HTML5 compatible browser. The new console allows you to multitask. It means it integrates a background task management system, multi-window, and will have you having to keep reading pages. To access to this Appletish Fusion 5 administration console, you just have to enter your credentials on the authentication screen. The console has been entirely redesigned based on its usage, as observed by the administration team. This is why it has been split into four broad workspaces, which correspond to the four main activities which an administrator is likely to run on a daily basis. Navigating across workspaces is also designed to run natively on a tablet. From the home page, you can get a summary view of the current status of the Applidis farm through various modules. You can use the top bar to navigate among different workspaces, view ongoing tasks, go to the help menu, manage your account or logout. The top bar is always available regardless of uh, which screen is currently in use. Let's begin with the infrastructure workspace and having to deploy infrastructure. To access to it, you just have to click on the related icon. The workspace will open and appear in the top bar to remain accessible at all times. From this workspace, you will be able to build and manage your Applidis farm. The constellation display gives you a holistic view of all your infrastructure. You will therefore find the central item, which is the most important one, the Applidis administration servers that act as connection brokers and allow you to manage load balancing, databases, monitoring services, provisioning services, VDI services, and more. The application servers, which host the applications to be published, you can combine any type of operating system servers without any limitation. 2003, 2008 R2, 2012 R2 within the same Applidis farm. Host virtual machines, which allow you to use a third party hypervisor to publish virtualized desktop under their full VDI names that can be found on the console. A database server and related backup databases. A gateway servers to ensure secure accessing from outside. User web portal servers for publishing applications through a portal and finally desktop which are automatically registered when Applidis access it. Besides building your architecture, this workspace also provides you with a snapshot view of the basic information you need to know about your farm. Uh, this way you can obtain details about the servers um, I assign to each Applidis role by clicking on the relevant item which will open uh, the right hand panel. You will find there a list of the server assigned to the selected role and by clicking on the individual servers you can view its properties. You will therefore find a color code uh, that is the same across all workspaces. Uh, the red and green circle inform you immediately about the firm status. You can see that uh, some of the firm uh, servers are inactive. The pop-up window show an interesting feature in this new console. Each window offers all the ergonomics for managing a large volume without any difficulties. For example, if you are trying to locate a server in a large size farm, you just have to enter the first letter in the search field and the search is done immediately. Once your infrastructure is set up, you will be able to publish an application and or desktop to your users. You just have to access to the publication workspace and I mean you to link application and uh, virtual desktop to users within subscription. The Xbox space also offers a summary view of all settings, meaning uh, the number of recent and or published applications, uh, the number of users group, 
and the subscription which will allow you to link application and desktop to this users group. Here we can see all the available applications, quickly locate an application and manage the detail of uh, an application. Not also the help button in the top right corner of the window which lets you access to the corresponding section in the administrator's manual. To publish an application it's easy and just click on add subscription and you can link it to users. So here you select the application name, you then select the users group and here as soon as the subscription is generated it appears in the list of publish subscription and that's it all users from this users group are able to see now their new application in their applidis portal there the users can find all his available application as well as his disconnected application Your Applidis farm is set up, uh, your application and desktop are published and your users are active. So now we are going to manage this farm. To do this we need to go to the overview workspace where you can view the farm status in real time in a highly synthetic form all on a single screen. Here you can see four categories, users indicating who is connected and who is running which application from which workstation. Infrastructure servers, providing the status of the administration servers and the gateways. Application servers, displaying their own status, CPU, RAM and user load. And databasing, showing the status of the database, main or backup and information about requests sent to the database. Also, note that these four categories are circle. This shows you the status of each particular category according to a color code red there is an alert green everything is fine we try to provide you with all kinds of information using visuals that let you know immediately the level of emergency required for each action for example uh, for the application servers you will find here a red color hack representing the percentage of server in a critical status out of the total number of applications servers In the first column, you will find information about users. Here you can see all the users who are currently logged on or in the process of logging on. From the summary view in this column, you can view the detail of logged log on users. In this session, we can see a list of applications currently opened by users and we can interact with them, take the control, reset or send a message. In the remaining columns, we'll find information about the administration servers, application servers, and database servers. All alerts and information are updated in real time to provide a quick and comprehensive view of your infrastructure. Finally, a track record all uh, the action performed on the administration console is available in bottom panel. You can also customize this interface by choosing whether or not to display certain widgets depending on how important that information is uh, to some administrator or not. You can also reactivate them if you want. The last workspace, the configuration one, allow you to define the various applied settings. Among other things you can define printing feature Applidis has an advanced printing feature for managing all the situation uh, from the simplest to the most complex cases. Mobile session, Applidis brings you functions that let you access to your session from any device. Load balancing, Applidis historically has the first intelligent load management system that allows to position users in the best possible manner depending on the firm resources. Gateway, 
APIs has its own IP diver product to ensure secure external access. Customization. The entire virtual application and desktop portal is fully customizable. The interface is endlessly customizable, including from the legal point of view. It means you can set up a delegated administration rights. If, for example, you have administrators who are specialized in monitoring and managing your farm or who are in charge of user support, you can grant them access to this overview workspace area only. I'm finished with the presentation of this new Applisys Fusion 5 Administration Console. For more information, you can visit our website, systancia.com. You will find the various ways to test our solutions and to contact us. Thank you for your time and goodbye.